beyond that, what we're seeing now is a, an opportunity for, for players to have another chance of re-entrance, right? You're seeing distressed assets hit the marketplace. So right now, um, a lot of these people that over leverage, and that being some of the largest miners, some small miners, some medium-sized miners, they're unable to pay their interest. There was two problems with the over leverage. The first problem is a lot of these miners collateralized the underlying asset, which was the mining rig itself, mm -hmm. at points when the, the rig itself was trading at 10 times the amount that it's value that it's worth now. Our industry was naturally also viewed as risky. So some of the interest rates percentages that they locked in could range anywhere from 15 to 40 percent. So if you locked in a high strike point of 10 times the value of, it, of its worth now with a high interest rate, you would need Bitcoin to be $100,000 for you to be profitable. And Bitcoin right now is $17,000. Yes, yeah. Ish. Yes, correct. So a lot of those players are trying to unwind. What we're seeing is interesting. Um, there, there's bid sales, there's uh, creditors that are taking repossession of their miners and renegotiating loans, there's bankruptcies. But with that, you're seeing a lot of distressed assets available. So not only the mining rigs, but these are power purchase agreements and mm -hmm. energy contracts. These are buildings, these are transformers and switch gears. This is high powered electrical infrastructure that is used to power America. So you're seeing the opportunity to buy these assets at uh, pennies on the dollar.